Hello everyone, in this video we are going to continue having some uh, Ohio State Geometry Test Prep questions. Uh, this question is one of the released items in the state test for the test takers to make some practice. So the question is about defining trigonometric ratios and solve problems involving right triangles. Here we have a right triangle. Uh, it's asking for us to find the value of tangent A. So this is a very basic question about trigonometry. Uh, the first step is knowing that what tangent is equal to. So there is this acronym for those who doesn't know, SOLKATOA. It helps you to identify what sine, cosine, and tangent is equal to. So from this acronym, this part explains us what tangent is equal to. It equals opposite side, O stands for opposite, over adjacent side. So A stands for uh, adjacent. So what we need to do is we need to identify opposite and adjacent side according to angle A. So let's locate the angle. Angle A is right here. What we need is the tangent of this angle. Tangent of this angle is opposite is 24 inches over adjacent. Adjacent means right next to it, right here, 10 inches. Uh, the adjacent side is can be a problem for most of the students. So here's an easy way. The one that is across from the angle is the opposite side. The longest side across from the 90 degrees is the hypotenuse. The other one is going to be the adjacent. So as long as you know what the opposite side looks like and what the hypotenuse looks like, it's going to be easier to locate the adjacent side. So now let's move on to our question. 24 inches divided by 10 inches, the units are going to cancel out because if you divide something by itself, they cancel out. 24 divided by 10 gives us 2.4. So the answer of this question is going to be 2.4. What you need to do is just typing 2.4 using the number pad over here. Uh, and another hint, guys, about the trigonometric ratios, you cannot have a unit, like inches, centimeters, there's going to be no units. The trigonometric ratios are about ratios, and ratios do not have any units. So that's all for this video, guys. Please comment below if you have any questions. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in another video.